Hey, Mike, what do you say we switch it up, man? We gotta. We've been so yeah. consumed with the NFL and college football and the mm-hmm. NBA lately, man. We've been ignoring. Yeah, a lot of good stuff. Um, some great stories in sports. Um, and some sports entirely in some cases. And one is hockey. We don't talk enough about hockey. All hockey? right. Hockey. I, I don't know, know about, about hockey. hockey. But like, well, we know that we know about hockey, man. Like you in Boston, you you practically yeah. cover the Boston Bruins. Come on. We know, man. We know hockey. Okay, we My had NBC Sports for up. crying out loud. That's come up. We know hockey. That's come up from a zero to like a four, four and a half. Michael, Five. the last time we talked about the Florida Panthers, man, we were talking about the fallout. The, the tragic and unfortunate fallout from the sexual assault scandal with the Blackhawks and the resignation right. of their coach. Well, Joel the Quindle. Panthers right yeah. now are, are tied with the Lightning atop the NHL standings with 53 points. Um, mm-hmm. The Panthers, uh, as of right now, are 6 3 and 1 in their last 10 games. They won again against last night. They have the second best, I know you love point differential. Second best goal differential in NH- no, NHL no, at 34. You love, you love <laughs> uh, they won six of seven. Um, you know, their coach, Andrew Burnett, uh, Brunette, excuse me, Andrew Brunette uh, is coaching the Atlantic Division team in the 2022 All Star game. It's, it's, it's great times in, in Florida. Um, and I think yeah, last night they beat great Vancouver, time of the game, man. right? I mean, it's, it's a it's, we got to start it's, it's watching more hockey. Be. Right, it's a place you want to be. So the yeah. Panthers won last night, and Kodak Black won last night, and so everybody wins because today everybody's talking about the Florida Panthers. Now, um, this is great. Unless you've been under a rock, and by under a rock, I mean off the internet today, off social media. Uh, you've seen the video. So we're not going to show you the video. If you oh, haven't seen not? the video, because we're trying to show keep our gigs. Come on, we're trying man. to keep our gigs. We're it's trying to keep our gigs. Okay, cool. I, 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 and I agree. I agree. I, I, Michael, if you were the president of NBC Sports, as you, yes. you know, hypothesize or, or as you, you know, had the hypothetical last segment, we would show it. Yeah. Okay, we would show it. But <laughs> yes, we would. You're not. <laughs> so we're not. Uh, we're gonna try not to get ourselves in trouble at home anyway. But yeah, there was some twerking going on up in the suite at guest of right. the Florida Panthers, Kodak Black. Um, I say it's a next win-win for all parties involved. It's next, next to the, to the executives, executives who, too. Who, right? Who, who were like? Who were probably like? Yes, this is exactly what our sport needs. <laughs> okay, yeah. this is why you invite Kodak Black somewhere. And if you're Kodak Black. I don't know the relationship with the young lady, but this is why you take her out. See, some people will say this is why you can't take certain people nowhere. I say this is why you take that certain person <laughs> that's anywhere. Great. That's a great. Okay. <laughs> that's a great tweet. Oh, it is. Oh, I thought you were hey, laughing at my line. I thought you were, I thought you were laughing at my line. Right. But but hey, I man, say this know. is why you take this woman anywhere because I because I wasn't appalled. I wasn't clutching my proverbial pearls. I was yeah. jealous, quite honestly, Michael, because it's been a while since I've been out here like that. It's been a while since I've been in these streets like that. You know, I mean, you know, yeah. my wife takes care of business behind closed doors. Okay, hey. but and that's none hey. of your business, but it's no, been no, a while no. since I don't Just know about you. It it's been a while since I've been twerked on. I ain't been twerked on in a minute in public. I have not received that level of public that public display of, of affection with somebody twerking on me in public. It's been a, it's been a long time, long time since I've yeah, had long, long, So I was long, looking, long, I was long, like, I remember long, long, them days. Long time I remember ago. them days where you just didn't care. You know, and where y'all kids. just, you know, like when last time you was, well, you was just wilding. We, we too old, we grown. We got too much man, to lose. That's not on brand for on, us. Now. We don't wild out like that. Remember you used to hey, wild man. out back in the day? No, let me tell you, Mike, Mike, I've been I've been old for a long time. I was probably like mm-hmm. when I was 19, I was probably 35. You know what I mean? Right, hey, I ain't right, gotta go, yeah. gotta pay these bills, gotta get to work. Mm-hmm. Hey man, you're a teenager. Relax. But I didn't. I didn't. I was I was always working. So I can't say I ever did it. I, you know, when my midlife crisis comes, and I'm gonna tell you right now, when you see me doing this, because I might, you know, he gave me some ideas. Kodak Black gave me some ideas. When I go to a Bruins game and I start doing that. Then you know what it's about. It's about a midlife crisis. So, because I missed out, I missed out 
but it's also a copycat, copycat league, league. So all of them, all of them, <laughs> all right. So maybe that's the trend. He looked like he was having, Te- he was having fun. And just for the record, living his he was best not, life. He was not. No, there was doing, no intercourse happening. At least I don't think yeah, there he was. Not doing. I'm, 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 I'm ninety nine percent sure they were not doing the damn thing. Um, they were close. They were close. Yeah. I mean, and technically, they did get a room. Technically, I mean, it was a suite. People could have been technically get a room. room. It's a know? suite. <laughs> I mean, you, you know said, get a room. I got a room. So right. you know, I didn't tell you. you know, to, I, I didn't tell you to put the cameras on me. Did I? I mean, I, I, you I, see the NHL. They deleted the tweets uh, recognizing that Kodak Black was at the game after all this went down. Like, what you got to be ashamed of? This is a great moment in hockey history. The internet has been going nuts, as Paul Wall once said. This is a great moment in hockey history. I think Gary Bettman right now should be patting himself on the back. Hell, for all I know, Gary Bettman right now is somewhere getting twerked on in celebration of this Never. crossover pop culture moment that hockey experienced last did. night. Thanks to Kodak Black, who I know his name, but I have not listened to one of his tracks. I don't know about you. Not but even I don't before, know nothing about Kodak. Not Black. even before today. Not even before today's show. You're like, hey, Kodak Black. I'm old. Who's oh, Kodak not for, Black? for research. No. Well, I mean, I, I've heard no, of man. him. I knew he was a rapper, but I don't listen to his music. At least I don't think I listen to his music. But I mean, that's just because I'm old. That's just because I'm old. Still, come on, so, show prep. It, yeah. It's fun. It's fun. It's just fun. It's just I'll fun ask Mason. I'll ask Mason about it. Oh, I'm not saying his music isn't good. It might be good for all I know. I'm just saying I've never listened no, to it. I didn't say it, it was good. Mason no, I didn't say it was good. Oh, okay. no, I didn't say that. Oh, okay. <laughs> let me just, okay. Let me okay. just point that out. Okay. I, I didn't say it was good. But you know, this is where this is where hockey and, and some of the sports that are on the margins kind of overthink it. It's not just one thing that makes your sport popular. Usually, you, you're not going to make your sport popular in a boardroom. It's more organic than that. Sometimes the popularity comes in ways that you'd never imagine. Like back in the day, now this is when, let's see, let me just do some quick math. You were probably like 14, 13, 14. So you were part of this trend too, um, where, you know, brothers were wearing hockey sweaters, jerseys. You know, and, and oh, starter yeah. jacket. I, I had a couple of them. Uh, yeah, absolutely. I yeah, exactly. Okay, that, that was great. Yeah. Then you know the NHL it had an NHL video game, yes. so it was a great NHL video game. I used to work Theo Fleury, the Calgary Flames. Uh, 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 nice. So Blade, come on, Blades. Had, of, I'm a child of Blades of Steel. Thank you. Said uh, Mighty Ducks, yeah. San Jose Sharks, all these expansion teams at that time coming into the league. That helps with the popularity. Sometimes celebrities come to your games. We grew up on Gretzky, man. Like, Twerking. and not to mention, and, but but here's the thing: all well, jokes aside, yeah, I, I agree with you. But all jokes aside, there is hockey, and then there's attending a hockey game. Yep. Ho- attending a hockey game, especially rinkside, will change your life. It will nothing, absolutely nothing like change it. your life. There is oh, I agree. nothing like it. And not, and then, needless to say, there's hockey, and then there's playoff hockey. You know what I mean? That's a whole different animal in and of itself. That's a, that's a separate sport, practically. Um, but honestly, Michael, like quick hockey story. Not only was it Blades of Steel for me, not only was it Gretzky back in the day, but as a kid, bro, I'm gonna tell you, hockey had me hooked. Speaking of the Canucks, Rangers Canucks, right before the, oh, the yeah. strike, ninety four oh, was a strike or lockout, yeah. right before the work stop stoppage, bro. Yeah. I was up all night, every night in New Orleans, watching Messier and the Rangers in the curse. That is one of my formative hockey memories. Sure, that is one of my formative and sports it's- memories. Is ending is the Rangers ending the curse? And now for a new generation of hockey fan, Kodak Black getting twerked on is a formative hockey memory. So it all comes full circle. Because they should be they should be working on a promo now. This is what our game does to people. Our games are so it exciting. Br- Thank I, you. I mean, I, it, our ga- hey, they bring our out game the turns best you on. in you. Our yeah, game uh, turns oh, you on like no there other it is, sport. There it is. Simple. Simple. Look at, simple. Look at that. Look at that. Our I'm, just, game, I'm solving problems well, you, today. First block, you saw Bruh. you saw the New York Giants, and that's a marketing campaign. NHL, our game turns you on. Our game turns you right. on. Right, right. I like that. You want to get excited? You want to get excited? Come to a hockey game. This is great. Oni, you want to go to the game? Take advantage of this. Oni, you going to the game? You want to go to the game? That was very, that. very Will Ferrell of you. Hey, thanks for watching Brother From Another on YouTube. Make sure you hit subscribe before you leave and be sure to watch us 3 to 5 p.m. Eastern Time on Peacock. Appreciate you.